Good morning, Wildcats. Today is Wednesday, February 8, 2023. And this is Emerald Hill. And Raphael Jenny. Bring me the news for today. Also remember to click the subscribe button at the bottom of the video so you won't miss what's going on at Woodmore Elementary School. The weather today will be partly sunny temps in the, low, in the lower 60s. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Pledge of Respect. I am a smart, special, and viable person. I respect myself and I respect others. My words and actions are kind and honest. I expect only my best in all that I do. I am proud to be a woman student. You may be seated. Today for lunch we will be having sweet beef and cheese nachos, turkey and cheese sandwich, cheese and veggie salad platter, tater tots, black bean salad, red gold salsa cup, fruit cup, and milk. Here's the word of the day. Scrutinize. Scrutinize means to examine carefully, especially in a critical way. Coming up next is the Wilmore Elementary Sports Update. What's up? This is Sam Neighbors and Zachary Ace. Winning you this week's sports update. Tom Brady is 100% done with the NFL signing a contract with Fox Sports. Atlantic won the Hockey All-Stars tournament. This is this this week's Woodmore Elementary School Sports Update. Here's today's Black History Month fact. Ruby Bridges. Bridges probably had no idea that the bolt actually committed in 1960 when South Chain Reaction leading to the integration of schools in the South. She was just six years old when she, came, when she became the first African-American student to attend William France Elementary in Louisiana, in Louisiana at the height of the segregation. How the Ruby Bridges Foundation exists to inspire the next generation of leaders to end the racism together one step at a time. And this was today's Black History Month fact. Up next is the National School Counseling Week update. Good morning, this is Mariana Majalo and Lance Thomas. And this week we are celebrating National School Counseling Week. As you know, our theme for this week is school counselors, helping students dream big. Today, we will talk about Miss Dobson's dream for our school. Her dream for our school is that every student feels supported and welcome. That we treat each other with kindness, embracing and celebrating our differences, listening and learning from each other. Author Andre Lord said, tomorrow belongs to those of us who conceive of it as belonging to everyone who led the best of ourselves to it and with joy. How can you help meet goals for our school? Can you reach out to someone today to ensure they, they feel like they are part of our school community? Do you feel like you belong? Let's talk about how we can make our school a safe and nurturing space for all of us. You know where to find Miss Dobson. Have a wonderful Wednesday. The PTO is selling Valentine's Day candy grams. Each, decor each decorative gram includes a card and a candy book bouquet. The cost is $5 for three different candy grams. The PTO will deliver candy grams on February 14, 2023. Parents can buy candy grams on February 6, 2023 through February 10, 2023 on the PTO's website, www.woodmorepto.com shop. The PTO will also take orders in person during lunch on February 9, 2023 and February 10, 2023. Cash payments only. The Valentine's Day dance will take place on February 10, 2023 from 6 p.m to 8 p.m. here at Woodmore Elementary School in the cafeteria. Parents must attend the dance. Please check the flyer for more details. Happy birthday to all who are celebrating your birthday today. Here is a birthday shout out to Maxwell Mills in kindergarten. If it's your birthday, please come down to the office to get a birthday sticker and pencil. Have a wonderful teaching and learning day. Go Wildcats!